Hello everyone, in today's video we're going to be going over the Morecam J7 battery powered doorbell camera. Play it anywhere, monitor anywhere. 100% wire free, no cords, no wires, no worries. And this is also 1080p HD, has clear night vision, PIR, motion detection, real time alerts, wireless chime, full duplex, two way audio, rechargeable battery that is built in and the ability to have cloud and local storage depending on which one it'd be more suitable for you so let's go ahead and dive a little bit deeper into this and let's go ahead and do the unboxing go ahead and take all the wrapping out right quick first off we have the user manual sitting right inside lay that to the side then we have a couple of our stickers just to post up around the house unconditional lifetime warranty card go ahead and lay that out of sight and then here is the actual Morecam unit itself alongside the module device and also comes with the batteries okay now since we got everything out of the packaging this is what we got we got the actual camera module itself then we have the sync module essentially and then the user manual alongside two of the monitoring security camera stickers as well. But let's go ahead and dive a little bit deeper into the Morecam J7. It does have 1080p full HD night vision via the Cloud Edge app. The video doorbell camera transfers 1080p HD live video and playback video to your phone. And it can still record full HD live video even in the dark. A better view of the situation around the house with 166 degree wide view angle. This is an ideal choice for you to ensure your outdoor safety for a long time. Now let's go a little bit deeper into the PIR motion detection and instant alerts. The PIR detection and body filtering technology only detects mammals or anything above temperatures of 86 degrees Fahrenheit, largely reducing false alarms caused by rain, snow, or leaves. Alert notifications can be pushed to you and users you share via the Cloud Edge app in real time wherever you are. Now again, this does have two-way audio and voice message. The video doorbell has built-in speaker and microphone. You can have a real-time communication with your visitors or select a pre-recorded voice message for quick responses. You can also warn strangers to leave that have not received your invitation. Protect your family whether you are or are not at home. This is definitely going to be one of my lengthier videos, guys, but I do want to be a little bit more in-depth and I'm going to try and start structuring my videos to be as thorough as possible so that is what i'm doing here today just playing around with it please if you guys do like this and like all this information please hit that like button comment down below let me know what you guys think about this video and give me a little bit of feedback so i can continue increasing my content quality another thing i would like to speak about is the ip65 waterproof technology where you can rest assured that you can put it outside for monitoring your home safely no matter how the weather changes as a doorbell camera for outdoor use, it has a 6700 milliamp large capacity rechargeable battery, which can make the wireless doorbell camera last three or four months if activated 20 times a day. And the phone app will remind you to charge it when it is low. This is an ideal choice for you to ensure your outdoor safety for a long time as well. This video doorbell camera supports cloud storage and up to 128 gigabyte SD card. They actually provide a 32 gigabyte SD card that has already been inserted into the device. And there is a cloud service trial for seven days. If you guys get this camera, you can store important moments and never pay the endless monthly subscription fee for cloud storage, which is very fantastic. That's one of the main things that everybody has steered clear about on the Blink home security camera systems or even the Ring video doorbells. I've been seeing a lot of negative feedback about the actual Blink subscriptions. So this right here would help with that and it already comes with a 32 gigabyte SD card included. Super cool as well. Easy installation, has the mounting bracket. You just install the doorbell and then tighten the security screw. Really nothing to it. And I forgot to mention the overall price and the price of this is only $89.99. It was originally listed at $119.99, but they actually did send me this product. I forgot to mention that in the very beginning. This is somewhat of a paid promotion, 
but it's not actually a paid promotion. I'm just going over all the various features and details for you all, like how to set up the Cloud Edge app, which is exactly what we're gonna start doing right now. Go ahead and download the Cloud Edge app. And once you download it, just open it up. Then you will enter your login information if you already have it, or you will need to sign up by entering your own username and password. After that, you can go ahead and start adding your devices. If you have multiple devices, you can add them one at a time through the Add to Device app. Just go ahead and press it and go to the doorbell because that's what we're doing today. Please follow the notification manual instructions to safely set it up. Press the bell button and tap next. So let's go ahead and press the bell button on the camera unit. Press next. Then press the reset on the device as well using the specified tool that came with it. Go ahead and press it down for five seconds. Wait for the LED to flash. And then soon after that, we will be connected to the Cloud Edge app. And then we can start the installation process, connect our Chime and get everything set up from there. So stay tuned for that and let's go ahead and get started with it. Let's go ahead and power on our Chime. Go ahead and put our batteries in there and figure out how to connect our Chime as well. First thing we're gonna wanna do is go ahead and take the batteries out of the pack, of course. Take the back off of the Chime and place our batteries in like so. Go ahead and power on the chime. Let's go ahead and plug it in. Now, after we have the power supplied to it, go ahead and press the reset button, which will be over here on the top. Boozam. Okay, and it's just that simple. Let's go ahead and move on to the installation and we'll check everything out from there, guys. All right, guys, I got me a nice little spot to mount it. Actually got my little more cam sticker and everything right there. So I'm gonna place it about right here, about this height, about four feet off the ground, four and a half feet off the ground. That'll be a proper uh, space off the ground that you need and also provide perfect amount of coverage for you to uh, see exactly what you need to. Let's go ahead and put this right here and I'll show you how easy the actual installation of the camera is once you have this mounted. It'd be super simple, so let's check it out. All right guys, now that we got our mount placed exactly where we want it on the door, let's go ahead and push our camera in there and it'll just kind of snap right in there. Now it's in there nice and snug, trying to pull it away and it will not come out. So that's awesome. Take a lot of force to relatively good amount to make it come out. So that's nice to know. There is also a fastening screw that is placed right there where the arrow is pointing and it actually fixates the actual camera to the mount. I forgot to press the record button so I didn't get footage, but I figured I would go ahead and place that in while I was editing so you guys would understand as well. All right, everyone, this is what it looks like during the nighttime. I don't have any actual footage during the day, but the camera quality during the nighttime and during the daytime is actually fantastic. So. You won't have to worry with nothing there. You can actually see most of the definition and see all kinds of different things during the uh, nighttime as well as the daytime. So super cool, but it is messed up. My backyard is looking rough. It's looking like a jungle back there. It's really messy. So I apologize for that, guys. But I do want to thank you all for watching. Let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to Real Life Unboxing, and as always, keep it real.